I'm Kevin Callan, Managing Director of uh, WLR Precision Engineering. The company was formed in 1969. It's a family business. We started out in the aerospace industry. We now um, deal with oil exploration, pharmaceutical, power generation, metrology equipment. So we're quite varied in what we do. We've only really been um, working with staff for about two years. Um, so I hadn't really considered sliding head machines before. I'd always looked at CNC lathes with um, power tooling or subspindle. We manufacture quite a few parts under 32 millimeter diameter. So when I was actually looking around for machinery, I came across Star and they're quite local to us, felt comfortable with the company. It was really more of an add into our capability than, than going in a different direction. Taking parts off of a fixed head or a colic bar feeding CNC and being able to do more operations in one that, would, that attracted us to it. In terms of accuracy, we're, we're machining parts that we were having senseless ground before. We're holding tolerances of O1 regularly. Um, so it's reduced operations, it's reduced lead time. Um, we're now effectively doing two turning op operations and milling operations all in one. So our shop floor time for the job is reduced massively, our lead time. We've got a good relationship with Star. Nothing's really too much trouble. Any questions we've got, any of the guys that are working on the machine can, can phone up and speak to somebody on a technical basis and get the help they need. Everything else when it's come to buying collets and all those sorts of things, there's no problems. Everything seems to be available and here the next day and the service has been excellent. We've had the basic training with the machine and then we had a, some update training and that's been very good. If there's any, been any other issues with knowing how to use certain parts of the machine, a phone call generally is enough to to get us moving, you know. But uh, they will come over as well and, and give us some help if we need it. The machine we've got is the first sliding head we've had, so we're limited on experience. And we did purposely go for a relatively less sophisticated machine in terms of how many axes it's got and how many tools. Uh, and, but now we're seeing what we can do. I wouldn't rule out you know, a, better, a more advanced machine in the future. Maybe we'd be able to do more complex angled parts and sort of things, so yes.